Wait, did you guys hear that? Hello everyone and welcome to this Dinkum Guide. Today I'm going to show and talk about a new NPC that I found a couple of days ago just wandering in the wild. But first let's talk a bit about what Dinkum is for people who don't know. Dinkum is a new early access indie game on Steam. You can play it single player or multiplayer and it's very similar to uh, Animal Crossing with its art style and interacting with the world. You can get licenses to do certain jobs like mining, foraging, fishing and a whole lot more. Now let's get into the guide. Who is Ted Sally and what can this NPC do for you? There's not much information about this NPC yet. He is a mystery. Uh, Ted Sally seems to be a wanderer, an NPC that can be found randomly on your island and will make his presence known by the whistle. And you can buy special items and sell lots and lots of meat to him for a lot of money. He seems to have a decent range with that whistle, so whenever you hear them, he might be like 30, 45 blocks away. I haven't truly determined this, this is not yet confirmed by anyone in Discord or anywhere, as far as I'm aware anyway. He might be a little bit hard to find, but he should be nearby. All the things you can sell to him are crock meat, drumsticks, flake, and if you don't know, that's from a shark, normal meat, and you can sell them prime meat. All of these can be sold in their raw and cooked form. But the cooked form sells for a lot more to, uh, to Ted. So it's definitely worth cooking it all up before making your trip over to him once you found him. Now what special kind of items can we buy from him? You might ask. You can buy from him a battle shovel that does about 16 points of damage. Compared to uh, a copper spear, which I believe is only uh, only seven, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, a bone bow of 15 damage. Bone arrows. Uh, you can also buy burly boxes. Uh, I don't know if that's an actual thing IRL. Uh, sounds a bit weird, but those are for crocs, bush devils and sharks. And these boxes will lure creatures towards it. I'm assuming you're going to have to put some, uh, some bait in there. Some regular meat maybe. Who knows? I haven't tested those out. But uh, that seems quite promising. To buy all these items, not only do you need a lot of things to spend, but also you're going to need some materials. Just like with the scientist dude Franklin, uh, you're going to have to bring him some cash and also materials to actually craft the items. I won't list all the materials for it right now, and it's not to be found on the wiki right now either. Uh, I will link the wiki down below in the description. So if they add it in the future, you can take a look at it there. But feel free to pause the video at the right item for you. Because I will go over them in the video as you, uh, as you can see. I've tested out the bow and the battle shovel. They're pretty strong. You can uh, one or two hit most of the regular creatures. But sharks and crocs, for example, take about four or five hits. Still a pretty decent strong weapon though. Not gonna lie. Aiming with the bow can be slightly difficult, but you'll get used to it after a couple of tries. Now, I have no good information about his spawning behavior right now, um, or if he's always on the island. He is shrouded in a mystery and yet to be revealed. So if anyone has some more information about this new NPC, Ted Sally, please do let us all know in the comments down below so that we may, uh, we may share experiences with him and we may uncover the truth about what he is, what he does, how he spawns in, if he's always on the island or how you can best locate him. Please do let us know down below. And uh, as I said before, I will link the wiki page for this NPC in the description. Uh, so maybe you'll find some more information there once it has been added. I hope this video was helpful to you all. If it was, then please don't forget to hit that like button and comment down below. And maybe let me know what kind of guide video you would want to see next. Hope you all have a wonderful day. And I hope you'll make a whole lot of dings by selling all that meat.